In logic, a statement is necessary if, whenever the conclusion, not P and Q, is true, the statement must also be true. So for our conclusion to be true, P must be false and Q must be true. So let's go through each one of our statements and see if they are true in order that the conclusion is true. So if not P and Q is true, well then not P must be true because P is false, so this one is necessary. For number two, if not P and Q is true, Q must be true, so therefore this one is necessary. If not P and Q is true, then P or not Q is false or false, which equals false, so this one is not necessary. For the fourth one, if not P and Q is true, then not P and not Q is not false and false, which equals true, so this one is necessary. For the fifth one, not P and Q to be true means that this one here is true or true, which is true, so this is necessary. True is trivially true all the time, so this is necessary for any conclusion. And uh, ditto false is false always, so that's never true regardless of what the conclusion is. And so therefore the number of the statements which are necessary is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, which is answer D.